The CBN on October 26, 2022 had announced its plans to redesign the three banknotes. President Muhammad Buhari subsequently unveiled the redesigned 200 Naira, 500 Naira and 1000 Naira notes on November 23, 2022, while the Apex Bank fixed January 31st deadline for the validity of the old notes. From that time till now, citizens have been encouraged to submit their old Naira notes at banks nationwide. With the deadline fast approaching, one might argue that the old Naira notes are still very much in circulation as seen in some of the stories we've heard, such as the case of the Cardinal beggars who refused an old 1,000 Naira note offered to them, and the family in Niger who rejected the old Naira notes offered as bright price. <laughs> Today we're discussing the old Naira notes versus the new Naira notes. Please let's hear what you have to say. Remember, you can join the conversation. Send us an SMS or WhatsApp to 0818038-4663. You could also tweet to us at WayShowAfrica1 with the hashtag WayShow. Okay, so today we're talking about the new narrative versus the old narrative. And I mean, listening to what um, Alera said, her, what's in the news about, uh, you know, People saying, okay, they've taken their money to the bank, the bank has rejected. rejected and like I also read as well, people in the riverine areas, the uplands, you know, mm -hmm. in as much as I understand that th there's that um, policy that says a country's currency should be renewed within five to eight years. And yeah. if, we, if we're going by that, you know, the Naira is actually long, long overdue, overdue yeah. for a redesign. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, it's, it's been, I mean, the 1,000 Naira notes has been there for, what, I think, about 17, 17 years, yeah. years now. So, I mean, yes, we're overdue for, you know, design. but like NJ rightly said, What's there are the so rush? many things. What's the rush? What's you know, rush? you only made this announcement, what? November. November, and then this is January. What's is the there rush? more? Is there something on? else we should know? Is there... Honestly, well, and, and even the way, with the way, okay, so since the news came out, we got, or rather the announcement came out, were you seeing Ghana must go of rotting money? <laughs> so why, yeah, honestly, so, so first of all, when I heard the news, I was like, why? Mm. Why now? Yeah. Because, I mean, election is coming next year. That was, election is in February. Mm -hmm. Why are we making that decision now? Yeah. However, that, those Ghana must go of rotting money. Where have they been? I support it 100%. Of course. Because, I mean, based on what we're saying, it's definitely going to control so many things. However, by right, Nigeria. Once again. <laughs> once again. By <laughs> right, Nigeria, once again. Now, how do you want to share your thoughts on this? Well, like you rightly said, um, the Naira notes, especially the 200, 500, and 1,000 Naira, I mean, the change of those notes is actually very long overdue. Mm -hmm. 1,000 Naira has been in circulation for, what, 17 years. Mm -hmm. uh, 500 has been in circulation for 21 years. Mm -hmm. And then 200 has been in circulation for well, 22 right. years. So they should have changed it like two, three times. Mm -hmm. But I mean, the thing, the question, the original question is, the change, the redesigning of this currency, is it actually going to curb what it is supposed to curb? Yeah. Because truth is, I understand why. Yeah. We are redesigned. Um, apart will from it the, work? Do you get uh, apart from the policies in place that we should redesign between? I mean, within five to eight years. Apart from that, I understand the other reasons for security measures. For instance, mm -hmm. they needed yeah. to curb um, the kidnapping. Mm -hmm. For instance, mm -hmm. they needed to curb counter because that's one of the, the, the uh -huh. major yeah. reasons yeah. Yeah. why countries actually change their currency yeah. yeah. because they need to curb counterfeit ahead. Mm -hmm. But true and true, is this is is this really the solution? Yeah, I think that's the original question. So Is this really the me, solution? For me, I'm wondering how it's going to control or aid inflation, like manage inflation. inflation. How? <coughs> okay, I'm so... Just, all right, let me let you finish. No, no, I'm, I'm just wondering. So, I don't know if anybody can help me here. How is going to manage... How is the redesign of NARA going, going to, to manage the, the pressure of inflation if it is done rightly? Yes. Because right now, there's not, there's not a lot of money in circulation, right? right? So a lot of people have hoarded, like you said, you've been seeing Ghana must go of rotting money. So people have kept money in their houses. So now they're saying, take this money back to the bank. Of course, before you can get word of note of the new currency, it's going, it's to, going take to take a, a while. Yeah. 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 So that's going to now help to boost the um, economy again mm -hmm. up until they start to steal again. Eh? Because that's the original reason for even redesigning to manage the, the, the yeah, place, to be able yeah. to you know improve the economy. Alara is not convinced. She's not convinced. <laughs> <laughs> Angel, what's your there's, thoughts? There's, see, um, like I said earlier, um, I don't think it's a bad idea mm -hmm. for the different reasons both the government and the people have given. Yeah. Whether it's to cur um, corruption, corruption kidnapping, kidnapping mm -hmm. inflation, whatever it is, is actually they're all right. Mm -hmm. But then again, the question is, 
is this is this the right time yeah is it a good decision for right now mm -hmm. what is the real real purpose for this because there's the there's the surface there's the surface there's the one that they want us to to know think mm -hmm. is the the reason behind it but there are other reasons so what are all these other reasons and were the people considered properly Before. when this decision was being made um, because it needed a time for people to actually like you said and and i'm not even talking about the really rich people because mm -hmm. they're the ones who have all the currencies that are, you know rotting that's because they've hoarded this yeah. currency for whatever reason yeah. they have for but the thing is it goes back to the market women it goes yes. back to the fact that we know that we are in a place where we're very cash conscious very very we're cash oriented yeah you meet uh, somebody on the way whether you want to say Apple hello call. to a policeman <laughs> or you Roger. want to say well done for work you have yeah, to you know it's okay. cash yeah. i'm not going to stay there and start doing a transfer, transfer. Mm -hmm. you know you go to the market or you want to buy water on while in traffic, yeah, traffic yes. I'm not going to do a transfer. Mm. I'm going to use cash. Mm. So I have, literally, I've seen the 1,000 naira note, and I've seen, I just saw the 500. I literally had to take it from my sister's wallet because she's a banker. So I just took it. I said, I've never seen this note. Let me take one. Mm. But I haven't seen the 200. I haven't cited it. And it doesn't look so different from the old I haven't one. even seen it. Mm. And this is the issue. Yes. How do people spend what they can see? Yeah. What they can't even it have. is it's going to be hard for the government to rush everybody so into a, a, a non-currency yeah. situation policy. Mm -hmm. and policy why because it's going to take a lot of you know awareness for this and the sensitization yeah. has to start from the rural areas because yeah. yeah. that's where they hold the cash yep. yeah. you and i can quickly say okay do you know what? i just take card. like the 100k or 1 million i mm. have in my house i take it to the bank and that's it and then I use my card. But these guys have a schedule because they want to make money. They have a schedule. Maybe they go to bank on Thursday. So they gather all their money from Monday yeah. to Thursday. Then maybe they put it together and one person goes to do the paying mm -hmm. and everything. They have a system that works for them. So this is totally going to put everything in disarray and in jeopardy. Yeah. And a lot of businesses are going to have issues because now a lot of businesses have to start trying to... Um, you know get uh pos machines mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. then if you're using the the pos merchants on the road they are charging. charging so you know there's going to be a lot of ripple effect to this and especially when you're getting on the bus are you going to are the buses going to be electronic are they going to have a, a cash machine on the bus like how quickly are we going to be able to catch up yeah. Okay, so this is us looking at it from the point of circulation, right? right. So, uh, I mean, when um, I talked about how the cardinal beggars have even refused to, to collect, collect the new Naira notes, they're not mm -hmm. accepting it. Even in Lagos, there mm -hmm. are some people that you take the money and I wanted to buy foil the other day, and then it was a new note I had, and I wanted to pay And they didn't guy. want to take it? And he was like, ah, no, mama, no, 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 I won't collect it, though. I'm like... But this is what they said we should start spending. Like, ah, he doesn't know which one is fake and which one's original. So yeah. that brings us to the point of quality. So right. now let's talk about the quality. Have you seen it? Well, <laughs> 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 so <that> day, <laughs> I was, I was, I was <laughs> with my friend, right, and then a group of friends, and then one of them brought out the one thousand, and she was saying, you know, I went somewhere yesterday, and then the person used tissue to, and he was bringing out blue, and I'm like, it's not possible. About, I, I, I like, hey, okay, please times. go and bring tissue. And that was how she. And he brought out blue. It was blue. So that means that that money is going is not going to you know how it wouldn't last you forget money in your pocket, pocket like you your 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 imagine that's in white in white in white pants okay. or you're sweating or water to, we know that that naira we used to sell tape naira back in Before, the day yes. Yes. this one would just fade off but in their defense the the the, the, the deputy uh, the what's it called the director of currency operations, operations yes. of cbn in his defense he said they didn't care so much about aesthetics he actually because they, they, I mean, bro, in his defense, he That's was like they were trying to. No, 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 he was saying they, they were trying to, you know, provide a profile rather a solution to a mm. current problem. So they didn't have so much time to think about what design should come in okay. or what design should not come in. So in their defense, that ink, the new ink, mm. is a secure is, is a form of security. Situation. Exactly. Yes, oh, well. I don't. Know. That's that's, maybe, that's maybe what they're saying. Is See, they're taking us well. for granted, but it's okay. <laughs> so I have the comments here. Okay. <clears throat> so um. 
the announcement was done in 20, November. November of 2020. Okay. So as at September of 2022, mm. the available data that CBN indicated was 2. Point, sorry, 2.73 trillion, <laughs> right? Yeah. That was out. Mm. <laughs> and then 3.23 trillion was in um, currency is in circulation. circulation. So that difference, how do how do they balance it? <laughs> so where the, where's the rest of the one point something billion? Uh, That's where they are asking people to bring their so money back, back to the bank so yeah. they can because they realize that 85 percent of the true. notes was not even the, it was not even so in where, the bank. Where, 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 it was where outside. Did they go? People That's hoarding money. money. Inside digging floors and putting inside exactly. I GP literally saw a video online mm. of a candidate a of a candidate of a current candidate, mm. and this was when the announcement was still being made. Mm. You know, the announcement was still being yeah. circulated, yeah. and during the campaign they were distributing the. And I'm yeah. like, this money yeah. that we haven't seen <laughs> is already in Ghana must go. <laughs> in someone else's <laughs> hands and that's the that's the problem mm. because the money doesn't the money is for the banks but it never gets there it and never it never gets, gets to, to the people it never gets to the end users and there's just this 20 percent or 10 percent of people who control the cash the actual cash and so it's 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 i'm sure a lot of people ordered this cash straight to their house well, from, the, from the banks <laughs> hence the reason why the banks have no cash to give to the people public. So they are basically giving the cash to the prominent mm. and the elites. Mm. Okay, so I mean, there's a picture that went viral at some point of the damaged, of the damaged um, current, yes, the old, the, yeah, I saw yeah, that. That, that. I even saw I one. Remember when, um, <clears throat> I, f f funny enough, when I saw that video, I thought it was like, um, you know, back right after COVID, mm. that they were finding warehouses with yes, different palettes. That's what I thought. Only for different, in rural areas, so they went to a warehouse and they saw, Ghana was go mm. of rotting money. Not one, not two, not three, not four. Yes, yeah, so that's that, that's 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 actually the new one. So you can see the damage that has been done just on it imagine. already. So just look at that. This is because this of mass production. <laughs> of the rush. Uh, uh, yeah. Of the rush. Yeah, so now that I think you're speaking in just this like game, the in how much, how defense. much was used what did you say? You're speaking Ahmed Mara's defense now, are Well, I'm, I'm just speaking based off of what he said. Mm. Because they, according to him, they had no time or they had just limited, limited time. time. So actually, so I would be just because, just like when you are produ doing production, mm. when you are rushing, there's going to be a lot of damages. Yeah. There's one that is not good. I, I think that's what's happening to the currency. So are we saying what, what, that outside? That based on where is the maker checker? Like for me, like where is no, no, where's the QA? Where's, where where's the, the QA? QA? This, this is something right? that is, is international. Like this money is going to leave Nigeria to a few other countries for that's literally you know, Nigeria's for legal tender. Yes. So that's your first how identity. do you explain that mistake? <sighs> Okay. Questions, questions, questions. Yes, I, I will that honestly, so for me, oh, I want I want if I say I want I don't want to say my prayer. My I want to plead with everybody. I think it's time for you guys to stop taking endurance for granted. Because we ask questions and nobody answers. And then they just feel like because on a regular basis, like if I were looking at let's say when it comes to your, your nine to five or if you have a business. Mm. And you have to produce something that people would use, even if you feel like these people are not, you know. It, you don't but it is them. your work. Yeah. If you give your work some type of, if you respect your work, you ensure that whatever it is that you're putting out comes out top notch. Do you even respect the country you served to produce a currency that does not even represent the country the way you want it to be represented? <laughs> okay, we'll take a short break. See you shortly. If you just tuned in into our ladies' night out and we are discussing the topic old narrow notes versus new narrow notes, please let's hear what you have to say. Remember, you can join the conversation. Send us an SMS or WhatsApp to 0818038463 or tweet to, tweet to us at WayShowAfrica1 with the hashtag WayShow. Our phone line is now open. Please call us on 070 We'd love to hear what do you think about the redesigning of the narrow notes and also do you think this deadline set as January 31st is feasible? I can't wait to hear from you. So, yeah, we're saying um, the UK also said they're redesigning yeah, their notes, notes as well, yes. right? And, yeah. But then they've given a deadline up until 
2024. That's 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 a lot better. That's a country that's working. because you know they are trying to like put it's the, the working, face working. of the, uh, King um, King Charles <laughs> yeah, the Third. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So they are trying to redesign the currencies. And that's fair to extend it up until 2024. That we way, that there's a long time. time to be in circulation. Because it's our time. own currency right now, if you go to the ATM, I don't think it's particular. Not all ATMs okay. are particularly dispensing the new you know, notes. No, no, no. I've been victim, actually. Oh, you see? I, I did a deposit into the bank, and then I went to the ATM so thinking yeah, I was going to get... I got back my money. <laughs> wow. Do you get and they were so all, oh, so I, I think I did... I did uh, 20,000. I got only 9,000 new notes, mm -hmm. and then the, the rest, rest were old notes. Were old so notes. So I had how? to also spend it. So it's like recycling. You don't have to run back so to the does bank. Does it mean that? No. Does it mean that some banks are actually trying to dispose of? Like, is it? I did not supposed to take that the old notes back. Okay, to so uh, we have we have we have, we have a caller. Have a caller. Okay. Uh, There's someone on the line. Binga. Hello. Binga, are you there? Yeah. So we yeah, have Binga from Lagos. Hello, Binga. You can hear me. Okay. Okay. I think okay. we I think for, lost for me, All right. So I earlier think, we spoke about the, the bright price I that was paid. Oh, okay. Hello, Benga. Good evening. Good evening. Can you hear me? Now? Yes, yes, yes we can hear you now. Okay, like um what I, what I'm saying is um if you people are taking us for granted as a country, what they are planning over time is gonna plunge this country into a crisis. You want to change currency just a few months before elections, and you're making everybody to hurry. That's like she was saying. I don't know your name, sorry. That's a bigger, uh, that's a deeper reason why these guys are playing this game. It's yeah. just for politics. Mm -hmm. Nothing. It's not about kidnapping. It's not about the welfare of the people. It's not about. It's not about inflation. It's all about politics. And if it's continues like this, like you're saying, the people that are getting these new notes are the rich guys. Mm. If I'm if I'm a rich guy, I don't need to go to the bank to get the new notes. The mm. bank managers oh. bring them to me. Mm -hmm. So the poor people can't even get access to this money. Truly, um, I'm tired of political, like what you call democracy in Nigeria. I'm tired. <laughs> These people are making us look like fools right. day in, day out. I feel you. Yeah. I think I hope you have your PVC. <laughs> yeah. Great. Thank you. So I hope you're going to go out there and make a good Bless decision. Bless you for that. All right. Thank you very much, Binga, for calling and giving your contribution. Thank <laughs> you so much, You know, Binga. imagine someone who has bulk of money, say 500 million. Now, I even hear that the AFCC. So if you go and then you deposit that That's huge the amount smartest of, way to cut They now come back now. to trade. Yes. So either way, the, I just feel like either way, the time is too short. It's too mm -hmm. short. Even though necessary, but the time is just too it's short. Too short. Yeah. And, it, you know, two months, mm -hmm. there's a lot of, like I said, Nigeria is a cash economy. Mm -hmm. The cash related. They didn't consider the, so there's the a lot to consider. And it, yeah. whether it's just about the elections. That's why I said the priorities were not set mm -hmm. considering everyone. Because if okay, we, what, we, sorry, sorry Angie, we have another caller on the line. Hello, good evening. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Pastor mm -hmm. Ladipo, good evening, sir. Yeah, this is Pastor Ladipo. Okay, go ahead, sir. I'm coming here. from Orilego. Thank you, sir. Now you see my take is this on this we designed my notes. Mm. I think uh, for the first time I would like to support the military and the president over this. Okay. The reason is this. If you look at the tension presently now, the this group of politicians that we have, mm. they don't have single ideology. So their plan is to monetize this election. And so the change of this Myra, they don't need a, if you give Nigeria one year, this is the way the thing will go. That is just the reality. If you imagine, take the case of the NIS. How long did it take? Right. So you should understand. So let's give them one year. The videos will not still move. So I will support them. I pray that I'll give them money anywhere to prosecute this election. Let them take it to the bank. That will save us. Okay, thank so you. Pastor Lepo, thank you very thank much. You. But then I'm, we're still saying, do you think this deadline is actually feasible? 
is it is it so possible? realistically we we would expect that they would extend it again like he said when i remember nim when it's this the announcement was made it was mm -hmm. years ago mm -hmm. even up till last year people were still trying to register for even nim up even now. up till now mm -hmm. so i believe that they would have to extend this if they really want to curb corruption and EFCC, they'll be having fun right now because as they are using their binoculars to be checking to make sure that who is who is depositing above 50 million. Oh yeah, let us know who you are. A lot of people are also scared because even you know legit businessmen yes. would still be looked as fraudulent people if they go and deposit that much money. So mm -hmm. it's a lot of I don't know how to place it, but this country we have so many. Um, I think we've gone beyond the part of our praying that God help us. <laughs> okay, we have another caller on the line, Stephen. Stephen, thank Hello. you for calling. Hello. Hello, Stephen. We can hear you. Go ahead. Yeah. Good evening. Good evening. Yeah, this is my personal opinion mm -hmm. that this changing of the note. I know 200, 500, 1,000. And uh, the time, three months, mm. it's okay. If we are asked to probably extension for one week, more, that will be okay. Let me tell you, Nigeria, Nigeria, if you give us two years more, the Naira will still be outside. So, if we are asking for one week, that will be good enough. Let's make this election to be corrupt, corruption free. Mm. Please, thank you very much. Thank okay, you. thank you so much, Steven. So, <laughs> Mr. Steven says, even if we're So, now this comes back to this now comes back to discipline. So, are we saying that we are that indisciplined in Nigeria? Yeah, that even if we are giving five years, People will still not go to the bank to deposit this money. So is that what we're saying? I, I don't agree completely because it is money. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It is money. Mm. You will not, it's not paper. Mm, it's money. And if you, if you remember, the only I'm going back to NIM because I know that it was until the telcos had to make it compulsory mm -hmm. that you have, to, you have to link your NIM with your phone mm -hmm. number. Mm -hmm. That was when most people started ensuring that, oh, their lines were bad. True. Some things had to happen to have to force people to go and do it. So yes, the time is short. However, if it's not extended, people would they want the banks will be flooded. How many million people do we have in the country? Mm -hmm. How many banks do we have? How many bank workers do we have that would attend to this number of people that will actually walk up in the bank and say, I have my Ghana Muslim of money, or I have my bag of money to deposit. The time is short, yes. I believe that the time will be extended. However, Nigerians, just, it's money. You, you can't let your money go to waste because it means like after the deadline and if they really stand on that, your money is going to be like paper. It's, if it's not going to be money what again, happens? nothing's going to happen. What happens to the cash that is not taken to the bank? If you're not How rich, I'm sorry, uh, this is Nigeria. If you're not rich, it's just going to go. You don't want to lose all You just don't want like to. That, do you? So mo that's why now the communication is going around to ensure that the people in the rural area, who are the people that a lot of, you know, we are most concerned about because mm -hmm. they are the ones that they've gone to the bank and the bank um the banks were rejecting this currency yeah, the yeah. old currency so yeah. they are the ones i'm really feeling for because they are the ones that you have to go and buy biscuits maggie mm -hmm. oil they're the mm -hmm. ones that the market you eat every day and they're the ones taking the money so they are the ones that should be considered so if possible maybe the bank should send accounts managers to go to, to a to specific market area, or a yes. specific you know area and say okay guys yeah deposit your money with it's easier for them they should also make it easy for customers or for the nigerians mm -hmm. to be able to go deposit their money they should make it easy so that we can deposit our money and can also I, get and the money can i add that churches yeah. have also <laughs> oh added, my god actually don't sorry, bring your offering <laughs> also added no. to online them. Saying that with the CBN deadline of Jan january no 31st mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that please Congregants should not, af after a stipulated time, <laughs> congregants should please not deposit. So maybe their baskets would be transparent so that you can see the <laughs> difference. Not putting... Because I don't understand how, so... if you're counting it, maybe if you're counting in the back room, you would know who gave what. But because maybe, I think some people would do sorry that. I'm sorry I'm digressing, but would you feel guilty if they've closed, <laughs> if they've stopped collecting the old note that you go to <laughs> church? <laughs> I think I need to just introduce my point because I was actually going to say it's Dami, one sorry, thing. sorry, okay. please hold that thought. We have another uh, caller right, on right. the line. Hello, good evening. 
Hello, good evening. And hello, good evening. Good evening. Good evening, sir. Go ahead. We can hear you. Hello, good evening. And hello. We can hear you. Go ahead. Okay, I think we lost that. Yeah, yeah I think we lost that color. Okay, you were, you were going to say um, something. So I was just saying that, you know, with the churches also giving a deadline, we're, we're going to have issues because, you know, on Sunday, and then, <laughs> you know, Alex asked if... If Boy Street, you answer my question. If, you will be, if, if it will be mean, yes, yeah, definitely. If Paraventure, mm -hmm. the, see, the bank have stopped collecting old notes. Yeah. And I have old notes. And I use the old notes to put offering. Is that bad? <laughs> you know in your heart that that is bad because the <laughs> because the because the church cannot take it to the bank well, God, honestly <laughs> okay don't forget our phone lines are now open you can call us on 070 and please don't forget to turn down the volume of your tv sets or whatever device it is that you may be watching us from while you're calling thank you Dummy. Yes, I was going to say, you know, it is one thing for Nigerians to be disciplined enough to, you know, take their monies to the bank. Mm -hmm. It is another thing for the bank to actually provide, and apart from accepting it now, to provide the actual new notes. Mm. Because I'm taking my old notes to the bank, but then I go to the ATM, and then I'm still withdrawing the old mm -hmm. note. Mm -hmm. I don't understand. How, is, how then is the new note supposed to be in circulation? So if the banks have made sure that the new notes are actually in circulation from, you know, ATMs, I mean, people that run POS businesses, for instance, yes. the cash they get, mm -hmm. they get it from the bank. Mm -hmm. So if we go to the POS and they still have old notes, well, That's they will still give old us old notes. notes. I, I Do you that. get? So, yeah. I mean, we, we first need the banks to make sure that there is enough new notes in the ATMs. So that mm -hmm. way, at the end of the day, you see that the old notes will keep going gradually because yes. It does, I, I don't think that it makes any sense to just, you know, what create a deadline. Mm -hmm. It should be mm -hmm. a flow. Do you understand? Like, exactly. Create a deadline. That then you are not making it easy for the deadline yeah. to even be met. Mm -hmm. So it's like, we are stuck, but there's nothing you can do. You're it's, right. it's, I mean. Because the money that we're, so for instance, now, if I pay for something with my card, that's different. Mm. But if I go to the market and I'm buying some something, from the market or yes. something, they go, they still go and deposit that money. money. So if there's like a cycle, I have old notes. I spend it. The person that the takes bank, it to the bank gets the, gets the new. Do you, do you get what it's I mean? So this, yeah, the process will it's be easier. Flow. But when we keep getting old notes, so it's like we're going we're round and around. And, say, and yeah. I, I mean, okay. So I'm going to ask: Do you think this move is a political move? Like one of our callers said that um, Lexi was right that he feels that there's more to this. It's not just about the defeating the counterfeit notes or creating a cashless policy. So like it's been speculated. Do you think that this is actually So maybe they're trying to control the flow of money or the I mean for me I, I, I don't want to agree completely because the truth is we would not know the decision has been made behind closed doors. Mm -hmm. But when we look at for instance now we say England they are changing their currency. Yeah. Ghana is also doing the same thing. They're speculating that you have to spend in gold now. Mm -hmm. So yes. a lot of countries are basically going that down that direction. direction. And if you also notice, there's inflation around the world. Mm. So there's so many speculation that we can't even place our fingers to say, okay, this is the particular thing. Because we would only just keep speculating. Mm -hmm. It would just be assuming, oh, is it this? Could it be this? And then at the end of the day, we're having propagandas and, you know, conspiracies around the, just scattering <laughs> things. So okay, so we have, we have another have caller it. on the line. Hello, good evening. We have a caller from Ghana. Hello. Hi, good evening. Hi, good evening. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, please, Hello, Ebenezer. Good we can hear good you. Evening. Good evening. Yes, we can hear you. Thank you for calling, Ebenezer. Okay, I'm Ebenezer calling from Ghana. Yes, I can hear you. Please go ahead. Hello, Ebenezer. Okay, all right. I think we lost him right there. Okay, Lexi, you were saying. Yeah, so I was basically just saying that um, we can't just keep continuing to speculate because, of course, that's what we're used to as Nigerians. When mm. we ask questions, we don't get the answer. Mm -hmm. We assume, oh, it could be this. It could be a political mm. um, strategy. Yeah. It could be... We don't know what it is. All we know as citizens is that please make life easier for us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because, I mean, okay, now it's even worse now with the whole fuel scarcity. You have to buy fuel. They will not collect old currency. What are you going to do? It is the citizens that are still suffering from this thing. So whether we speculate or not, it is what it is. 
we won't have a choice but to go with it however like dami said please make it easy on us mm. if there's if it's possible for, for there to be like a cycle in the sense that i am the one spending the money right mm -hmm. and yeah. then the people i'm giving my money to mm. is going to the bank so the conversation or the communication should go to business owners to say, okay because everything's about buying and selling. selling everything yes. about our life is you're you are going to wake up in the morning food you will eat you're exchanging your food for money your Let's transportation you're, you're exchanging it bus mm -hmm. drivers everything so if they make it at the end of the close of business business owners go and deposit the cash you have in the bank yeah. and ensure yeah. that as you even for instance i'm spending one thousand naira old notes mm -hmm. you should be giving me change in the so new yes, notes yes, yeah. the because we have because to help like that it takes mm -hmm. it takes a village it's not just the bank everybody like, we just we have to consider ourselves and ensure that I, I don't, for some reason, sometimes it just feels as if we don't love each other in this country. It's true, because if you really think about the next, next person, do you know how yes. hard it is to stand on a queue in the bank? Mm. And you have other things to do with your life. You go spend three hours in the bank that you're trying to deposit money. They're not really considering, you know, the citizens. And I feel like, hopefully, they're watching this show and they're listening to us. So they should make it easy. We've accepted it. But please make it easy for us Hello? to circulate okay. the money. Hello. 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 Good evening. We can evening. hear you. Please go ahead. Yeah, good evening. Good yes. Evening. Happy. Yeah. Okay. Please go ahead. Okay. I'm, I'm in support of the for the old note. I want the old note to be banned. <laughs> Why? Okay. So you're saying that you you prefer the new notes, right? Hello. Are you saying that you prefer the new notes? Yes. So what do you? Happy, what do you think about the redesign of these notes? You you think that these new notes are better than the old notes? No, for me, for me, I'm not talking about the designer. So I want the old money. Yes. I want them to ban the old money because Nigerian politicians they are doing more than themselves in this country. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> because they have stored so much amount of money in their way out. Yeah. What they want to use to. To bribe for the campaign. To bribe for this coming election. So I'm um, in support for them to ban the old news. Okay. Thank you very much for calling, Happy. Thank you. Yeah. So, like, Happy. But that doesn't really still stop it. Because they are still, like, like she mentioned, they still have access to their account manager that they will still call to say, now nah, bring bags of money for me. <laughs> That's yeah. one thing about it's politics. Not it's still not controlling it. Especially Nigerian yes. politics. They do things because of the politicians, but mm. it's we the citizens. That's so that suffer at the end of the game. That's the grass. That's just where we are. Elephants are fighting with the ones that Do you get? That's where we are. We don't get considered when such exactly. decisions are being made. This thing that we're even talking about, so we talked about the businessman that has a lot of 500 million yeah. to deposit. Mm -hmm. What happens to this market woman that is only 500,000 that she has and they refuse to collect it at the money? 5,000, you mean? Five. Well, <laughs> well, and yes, they refuse to collect it. What happens to them? <laughs> Yeah, so that's, that was the question. We yeah, were so we ask. also talked about how this is actually going to help to fight um, insecurity and, you know, help curb kidnapping and mm. all of that. What are your thoughts on that? Do you think really mm -hmm. changing the Naira notes would actually stop? You no, it changed the now. system. Oh, wow. It changed the you system because now. they started doing dollars. Exactly what I was yeah. just going to that say. We have, we, have, we, have a we have a caller. Hello, good evening. Hello. Hello. Hello, good evening. I can hear you. Please, can you turn down the volume of your device? I'm from Cross River. Okay, hi, Jimmy from Cross River. And um, Okay. I'm hearing you. Yeah. So, what do you think? What do you think about the redesigning of the Naira notes? And also, do you think the deadline is feasible? Can you hear me now? Yes, I can hear you. Can you hear me? And out of the design of the Naira notes, I'm thinking of. They talk the the country is turning all upside down. As now they were saying, see NIM and at least they block some people uh, So now we are taking this now to the fact that a lot of people in the fund have going to change the matter. This one we have to make a few in the fund. It's good to feel that we cannot get the new name. So you don't think the deadline is feasible? No. Uh, are you there? We can hear you. We can hear you. Dr. Jimmy, are you there? Okay, I think we lost him again. Okay, so I was saying, do you think the redesigning of the Naranos would actually curb kidnapping? And like I said, they just changed their pattern. Mm. So that's the thing. So in Nigeria, we're known to be 
adaptable we mm. adapt and that's the reason yes. why we don't complain too much about anything, anything. that yeah. is thrown at mm. us because give it a few months give it even a few days we'll have fun with it depending on how we'll find a way to get <laughs> around it memes around it <laughs> so that's the same thing for businesses as much as a lot of businesses will suffer mm. but people will learn how to adapt if the deadline is not Extended. And is it that that or some people will lose their funds mm -hmm. now for when it comes to terrorists they started collecting in Dumb. dollars mm -hmm. now you can't change as much as they want to change the dollars <laughs> maybe that's where that they'll be able that's yes. where the the, the countries way. will be able to curb the one happening in nigeria <laughs> oh, no, maybe they'll start with gold go change it to gold and bring it or but cryptocurrency. it would be a problem because how would they change it to funds they're they going to sell the gold. Bank Trust bank. me, it would it would constitute a problem. Okay, we have another yes, caller, uh, Zubairo. Hello, Zubairo. Good evening. We can hear you. Hello? Hello, Zubairo. Yes? Hello, please go ahead. We can hear you. Hello. Good evening. Good evening. Okay. My suggestion on this uh, redesign Nigeria note. As far as I'm concerned, there is no need of arguing about why this new note cannot be used as jewelry, something as jewelry. Once you get it, you just spend it. All my call to the federal government or CDM is that let this uh, new the design one be available so that we, the downtrodden customers or the people or the, uh, the local people, should have access to it any time they need. Okay. What do you think about the redesign that of the it. of the notes, Mr. Zubairo? Okay, okay, he's gone. Okay, I think we have we have comments. All right, so there's a comment from our Ways regular fan, Daniel Ilo, and he says, Good evening, my dear beautiful sisters of what are you saying? Hashtag Ways. Old Naira notes versus new Naira notes. Me, personally, I'm not against change. My dear beautiful sister, Umwa Jaga, asked a very serious question. Is changing the currency the solution to our problems, and why now? Are they telling me that without elections, there will be no change of currency? Right. I was discussing one of my friends some few days ago and I told him that I prefer the old currency and he agreed with me. My dear beautiful sister Alero, you're welcome back. Okay. Saying that I missed you is an understatement. It's been a while and happy new year to you. We love you. Thank you Stop so it. much, Daniel. <laughs> <laughs> I'm turning red. <laughs> okay, so we've looked at this from different angles. Okay, so let's take this caller. Hello, good evening. Hello, good evening. Good evening, madam. Yes, good evening, sir. I'm back here. I'm a Twitter. Calling from Ghana. Okay. I, I will not talk about the redesign of the road. Hmm. But I will switch the, 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 the timeline. I think the time is too short. One month. Yeah. I yes. want to remember 2017 when uh, Ghana TV was still. Then the president, the, uh, the book will give us one year. Yeah. Then the government gave us one good year. I think the one man is too short for you, Nigerian. So the government should have never said. Thank you. Thank you very yeah. much. Thank you so I, much. I agree. Like, the urgency is very suspicious. Right. It's really okay. So for the for the um, British, they say they're changing <clears throat> they changing the image. Yes. From Queen Elizabeth um, to, to Prince, Prince Charles the Third. They told Charles. us King the Third. Mm -hmm. They've told us why. Mm -hmm. Is it that they don't have counterfeits in the UK, <laughs> or there's no corruption in the UK, or there's no no? Please, I want to know now. So what because the reasons right the reasons that? given that they are given to us are because we're mm. Nigerians mm. is and then. The, Anyway, we'll see it here. It will be extended. I mean, the CBN has, th th that. there's a full handbook that answers, the, uh, it's um, a frequent, frequently asked questions about the new Naira notes. I think we should look at it. And it answers a lot of these questions, mm -hmm. you know. Uh, that's where they mentioned, oh, because of the cashless policy, they're trying to drive financial inclusion, mm -hmm. they're trying to um, curb um, insecurity, they're increasing the security features of the note as well mm -hmm. and all of that. Yes, I mean, that's okay. But then, it just seems like, Alara said, it's very suspicious. Why this sudden move within this very short time? And then you're telling us that if by the end of January we don't that's it for us. And it's What's delicate because it's money. It further proves that it's a political move, <laughs> in my opinion. It just further proves that it's a political move because all the reasons that they have stated for changing the currency are very valid, mm -hmm. as a matter of fact. True. But we know that that's not the exact reason because if those were just the reasons, I think they would time. have been exactly. Time. There would have been time. ample time to, for the money to be in circulation and various other things. But it's just like you must do it now or never. Mm. Why? Why? Clearly, it's a Why political move. 
Okay. I think what's that our color? <laughs> <laughs> yes. All right. So we looked at this from the angle of quality. We looked at it from the angle of circulation. We looked at it, and then we've asked ourselves: Is this really necessary? We've talked okay. about the deadlines. If the deadline is actually feasible. But before we go, do ensure you follow us on Instagram at Way Show Africa. You can interact with us further, drop a comment, and most importantly, follow all our social media engagements. And remember to like, share, comment, and invite your friends and family to watch and follow us. Thank you so much, NJ. Thank you, Dami. Thank you, Alero. It was nice being with you girls on the show nice. today. Lovely being here. Lovely if you missed today's here. course, here it is again. I don't have good news for those who want deadline of old Naira to be changed <laughs> because we will not move it. Godwin Emi Feely. Oh, See well. you tomorrow at 8 p.m. <laughs> as we bring another great conversation, conversation to your screen. Bye.